There are things coming even in 2.3 before, and that's in quarter three. That's within the next couple of months that we're going to get 2.4, and you're going to be fighting Thargoids. Now, if you don't think that's exciting, then I'm not sure what is, that you guys are going to be in open conflict with these incredible, fearsome things. Now, that's, that's, that's kind of it for me today. Um, I want to say a huge thank you to those guys who helped me out finding the puzzle. They can probably hear me, but... Um, I'm not going to bring them back in, but they were absolutely hugely important in making that happen. So there is going to be a forum post detailing this kind of stuff, but we wanted to set the tone for what it's going to be like. And so there's no way better to do that than to introduce the, um, well, the CEO of Frontier Developments and the co-creator of the original Thargoids, the man who knows how scary these things actually are. That would be David Braben. So he's going to set the tone. Thanks very much, guys. And I will see you in a live stream very soon. I've always been really fascinated by aliens and by, you know, the, the, that very word. It's things that are alien, things that are very different. And not just things that are physically different, but things that are culturally different, that have, have, have a different outlook. Of course, we've got the really exciting thing now with the encounters with Thargoids, and so little is known. Um, but what we do know is that humanity encountered them um, hundreds of years ago and the encounter didn't go well at all. We know that it was around uh, an ammonia-based world. We know that uh, they were very, very good at fighting. Now, since the few hundred years, uh, th since the Thargoids were encountered, there's been so much cover-up, there's been so much fakery that we don't really know what's real. But what's great is we've had some pretty clear and controversial evidence that it's there, and we're seeing more and more people encountering this very interesting, very strange alien species. There's rumor that some of the things in the past are true, but we still don't know what those are. We've seen the unknown artifacts, which behave very strangely. Um, we've seen the unknown probes. We've seen barnacles, which seem to be living creatures that can live in zero pressure on really cold worlds, that seem to be extracting substances from the depths of the, the planets and moons that they're on. As we see more and more um, alien elements appearing in the game, we will see more and more understanding of how they react. They are able to do things that we didn't think were possible, so their technology is very different. Encounters with um, alien species are unlikely to be perfectly equal, and I think that will be the case here. They're not necessarily, it's not necessarily that one is always better than the other. They're just very, very different. And quite often those differences lead to um, bad outcomes for one or both sides. And I think that's what we're seeing. More and more of this we expect to see over the next weeks, months and even years as we get to know this alien species more and more. But the Thargoids are the first big frightening species that we've met and we know relatively little about them. Today we've revealed a lot more will be coming relating to Thargoids in 2.4, which is obviously a very exciting time. This will come in uh, Q3 of this year, and we're doing something very new, something that I'm personally very, very excited about. So, um, see you in the black. So, um, I thought of one thing as well before we leave you as well tonight. I thought of one last, last thing as well that I thought I should do. I've written up a, a message that I'm going to send. Uh, and uh, let's see if this works. Uh, it says, this is an urgent message from Commander Lewis. There are forces out, forces out there who do not want you to know the truth, but I have to make this public. I found a ship in HIP 17044, a federal cap ship shot to pieces. They were carrying the data the Fed stole from Professor Palin. The crew is entirely dead, but they discovered something important about the unknown ships. There is a beacon in the record wreckage broadcasting a message over and over. It proves what we suspected. They are back, and the whole galaxy needs to know. The Thargoids have returned. Now, I don't know if this will work, but let's find out. Okay, you ready? He says very nervous. Okay, I'm, I'm pressing buttons on things. Bear with me while I press these buttons. I'm pressing OK. Things seem to be happening. Let me know in-game if you're seeing anything. 
<laughs> it worked. It worked on Xbox. It's going out. This is amazing. <laughs> That's so fun. Oh my god, it's going out again. It's going. I'm going to all. I'm going. I'm sending it to Solo. I'm sending it. Everyone needs to know. Everyone needs to know. The Thargoids have returned. <laughs> oh, see. All of those. A few more servers to send it to. This is hilarious, guys. Oh, thank you all for being here tonight. And thank you all for getting excited. 2.4 is going to be. It's, it's going to be great. We're going to have a good time. We're going to be taking on. These alien creatures are the first time. These, these creatures we've been spending time with for so long. We're finally going to be fighting them off. And uh, let's try this one. Oh, there you go. Finally, that should be everyone on the Xbox has received them as well. And that's it. Thank you very much for coming along to the live stream, guys. Thank you. It's been uh, an absolute pleasure. I hope that the, the event was a lot of fun in the end. And I'd like to do more like this in the future. Maybe not surrounding E3, but just other story events that we can all try and get take part in as well. So thanks again, and I will leave you with this wonderful little thing that Petit is wonderful. See you later.